Oh God, it's a uh, break my neck. Never had the courage to do a full roll, especially at my age, I might die. So hello everybody and welcome back to another unboxing video. Today we've unboxed, well not today, but we've unboxed some pretty good Lego sets. Um, we've had the Carnotaurus, we've had the Indoraptor in Lockwood Manor, Carnotaurus Escape, and even uh, the recent helicopter set which is pretty good. But there is uh, definitely one more that I'm looking forward to because it is the first time that we've ever had this dinosaur as a toy, or especially even a Lego toy, and that is the Sticky Moloch Breakout. So if we have a look at the front of the box, um, you can see this uh, contains Sticky Moloch, Dr. Wu, and a guard. Uh, still don't know whereabouts this takes place, because it looks like it's Dr. Wu's office. Retails at about £34.99. I'm sure it's probably about maybe $35, maybe $40. I'm not too sure. You know, I don't know whether they just change the dollar sign or if they inflate it with, you know, actual currency. Oh, God knows, whatever they do. It comes with the Stiggy Morlock, which looks like it's kind of a raptor, except for they've changed the hands a little bit. And of course, given it a Stiggy Morlock head and normal feet. Got Dr. Wu, so this is kind of reminiscent of the Indominus Rex breakout for uh, Jurassic World back back in 2015, uh, the more innocent times. An openable gate. Um, Dr. Wu with his tea. I think somebody, uh, I don't know what it was. <laughs> uh, but the actual actor, B.D. Wong, uh, commented on a picture of this because they're like, oh no, Dr. Wu is spilling his coffee. And he was like, it's tea. You got breakable windows, it seems to be. You got a gate. You can apparently tip over the um, the rest of his workbench with the egg and the sticky Moloch x-ray as well there. Oh no, I need to get me phone. Balls! Let's see if I can remember how to time myself this time. This Lego set doesn't seem to be too complicated. I quite like the uh, little touch of uh, lights there as well as all the little stickers like access granted. Without further ado, why why bother to keep analyzing it when we could get it out of the box? Roll montage! Yeah! Thirty-one minutes and four seconds later, it's done! <laughs> so it's kind of hard to see this set uh, close up, so that's why we're, we're quite low down here at the table. But it was loads of fun to do. It's um, it's kind of like basic in comparison to the other sets that I've you know created like the um, the Lockwood Manor Indominus Rex Escape uh, or Breakout set that was. Um, there was a lot more that went into that one. This one does feel uh, it's very reminiscent of that Indominus Rex Escape because you have the gate that opens and Indominus Rex Escape had very similar things like that. Um, and especially you have to make a fence twice and it's like exactly the same fence. And I'm pretty sure the, like I said, the Indominus Rex Escape had exactly that too. Yeah, if we take a look at the uh, Stiggy Moloch, uh, this is the, the unique dinosaur that you're only gonna get with this set. Uh, the only thing I've got to say about it that uh, hinders it is the fact that the, the uh, mouth doesn't open at all, which is a bit of a shame. All of the dinosaurs' mouths have opened in the past, the T-Rex and the Carnotaurus and the Indo Indoraptor, the Indominus Rex, they all open their mouths. And just because it's not like a carnivore, so it doesn't have a big jaw, it's got a beak, they decided not to open Stiggy Moloch's mouth. So that is a, that's a bit of a shame, but at least we have it, I've got to say. Uh, the only other thing is the markings on the tail aren't the same color as the body. Uh, the rest of it is, except for these uh, highlight markings, uh, like a dark red as opposed to a brown. Uh, not too sure what happens there, it seems to be something in the printing, because we had the same issue with blue, where the leg color was different to the body color. Like you can see here, the body color is it's very vibrant, and then the uh, leg color is a little bit washed out. And I think uh, whatever kind of printing they use must change that slightly, because uh, that brown is definitely not the same dark brown as that one. But really nice to see uh, a herbivore uh, that's not like a Triceratops or a Stegosaurus. It's got its own custom. Like, I don't think this 
has existed anywhere else in the LEGO franchise. This is the first time we're seeing a Pachycephalosaur rid, so, you know, Stiggy Moloch, I'm not going to say any scientific term because I'll get slaughtered in the comments, <laughs> uh, that we've seen. Comes with, again, a Dr. Wu, uh, a god, the first time we're seeing a god, so this must happen in the Lockwood estate, uh, maybe, where um, all that auction's going on and somewhere down in the depths, Dr. Wu's working on splicing all these genes to make a better Indoraptor that is tameable and they've had to rush out the other one quickly. Uh, so I'm just gonna try and open the gate. Yeah, there you go, look at that. Oh, that's awesome. It's a nice smooth action as well. There's no lock into place or anything, but it's nice and smooth. And if we I'll move uh, the glass over here, this is the glass that breaks. So if I was to just push it, there you go. And there goes this little desk. <laughs> well, for what it is, it's really nice. The attention to detail is really good. Like the, the stickers, the electric. There is a little ladder as well at the back, just in case your kids are like, oh, how does he get up there? Well, he uses the ladder. Just little little thoughts like that. Of, uh, it's nice to see them put that little bit extra effort in. Yeah, I think the inner, yeah, that inner one can break out as well. So the Stiggy Morlock can smash through to the office of Dr. Wu and then smash through the glass to get out. But again, it's Lego, so you're gonna get really, really good quality for what you pay for. I just want to double check, how much was it? Oh no, it was $34.99. <laughs> what am I saying? $34.99. Okay, okay, yeah, I'd say that's okay. Yeah, $34.99. I'd probably say that's the max I'd pay for. I'd like to pay 30 quid. I think the fiver is just being a little bit greedy. <laughs> but I don't know. I don't, like, again, like I said, it's quality. And if you enjoyed this video, guys, like, oh, sorry. I just wanted to like say the attention to detail is quite nice. Like they've even got a um, like a calendar. I think it says June. If that's right, is that June sixth? Is that the release of the movie? It might be. <laughs> that's a nice little touch that they've done there. As well as uh, the Stiggy Morlock printed there with its uh, X-ray, which looks really nice. But if you enjoyed this video, guys, leave a like. And until next time, I'll see you later. Oh, bye bye. That moment when you just realize you recorded most of the review and only got your mouth in shot. Yay! <laughs> oh dear.